Hey Reflector friends, this is Eye of the Dawn. Thank you for joining me here and watching and seeing what you can find about yourself and your reading. Okay, so Reflectors, you guys are ruled by the phases of the moon or it would behoove you to pay attention to the phases of the moon because, because you have so much inner tension from conditioning, it's really hard for you to sense what's happening like you can't you can't separate what you feel inside and like what's actually happening but you can see it clearly for other people though if you want somebody to tell you the truth about yourself it's going to be a reflector okay because you guys can probably read my energy up and down you'll be like what's wrong with you you know you guys are real read up and down but you won't confront it though you you're not going to say anything because you don't want the the daggers back at you because that's not something you can handle i get you all right so i'm gonna um shuffle for reflectors I'll pull some cards for you i'm just i feel like i need to tell you guys this my readings are not don't have any time stamp on them at whatever time you read it, it's okay. So if you're attracted to this video and at any point you feel like, well, I'll listen to it later. That's fine. You can listen to it next year. And that's what, and that'll be the right time. I don't, cause I don't like putting dates on my um, readings and stuff, but I guess it makes sense for YouTube, how things go on YouTube. All right. What's the message for reflecting? Something wanted to pop up, but it was like, eh, no. All right, so the first card that popped out is the sun. Innocence. <clears throat> Which is you. It really is you. And like I was saying before, you have a hard time seeing the truth within yourself, within your own being. And how, you know, you feel things very intensely. But, you know, maybe the situation isn't a 25, it's a 1. But it's because of all the energy that you suck in that you feel everything so super intensely inside. So there's, there's, um, there's... There's, um, hmm, there's a, there's a veil over your self-awareness and of what's actually going on. And the sun, um, reverse is still a really good omen. For some reason, I want to shuffle. Um, but when it's reverse, it's saying that you can't see the truth. Even though the truth is right, staring you right in your face. And then the Osho Zen Tarot deck is the innocence. You know, that when when you stare into Mother Nature, you're really seeing a reflection of yourself. You know, but you're not seeing yourself. What is it that you're seeing? Instead, let's see. Reflectors. You're not seeing your goodness all the way. You know, you may be, be criticizing yourself. More than you should be. Causing yourself stress. More than necessary. Reflect us. Interesting. You, you're, the cards, cards want to pop off for you, but then they change their mind. They be like, they're jumping, but they're not popping out. All right, there goes one. Okay. Hmm. So I pulled the transformation card, which is the death card. Hmm. All right. So. The Le the sun card reminds me of Leo's innocence. 
the sun sign Leo is very innocent. You know? And the death card is Pluto Scorpio energy. Moving you into deeper truths. Basically, you're moving into deeper truth of your innocence, your purity, your knowledge and understanding of yourself. You're, go, you're, you're, you're being even more purified. And it's not that you're not a pure person already, but your perspective and your view of how you fit in in the cosmos and the universe and society and your relationships as above, so below, macro, micro, you know... You, and when you go through a transformation, you change the whole matrix. And so you're becoming more aware of your part in the whole matrix. People may, or situations have made you feel like you're not as important. People like us um, don't haven't gotten all of our props, but we're starting to. It's a, it's a start. Take it. You know what I'm saying? I'll take it. That's how I feel. I'm like, I'll take it. Whatever comes your way, but within this initi these initiations, you'll be more your perspective of who you are will be more and more clear, and then you'll be able to have more and more boundaries, and you'll be able to be like, <laughs> right, that's how we used to get down, but how we're going to get down from now on in these Holy Ghost streets, you're going to respect me, and who I am in my being. And that is all I have for you, Reflector. If you would like a personal reading or anything with me, contact me. Peace.